Welcome aboard. I know you got a lot of questions, right? Yeah, I, I sure do. First of all is where we headed. Well, right now we're headed to headquarters. Headquarters is just across the galaxy from where your planet is. As you can see, you are a very long way from home. We should be coming up to my planet shortly, but as I said, we had to cross time zones first. So that's what that thing was? That What's that thing? That time warp thing? 9.0? Yeah. What do you see? Time warp 10. Ah, here we go. We're getting close to my planet now. It looks a lot like your planet. Really? Well, what other questions? Tell me something. What's going on with this box? Well, the box is a DNA changer. It changes white people dark, as you can see. That was one of the side effects. The thing is, we use it for sun tans on my planet, but with your planet being so much closer to the sun. Okay, we're almost here now. Mike Sear coming in. This is Big Brother Face. Mike Sear, okay. Mike Sear you, you are down. cleared for landing. Thank you. I'd like to thank you all again for coming to the Little Green Tea Baptist Church this morning. And we want to thank our visitors for visiting with us. Now, without further ado, we're going to have my dad come and deliver the message of the morning. You all know him. He's a distinguished speaker and has spoken in a lot of churches all over the country and around the world. Let's have a round of applause and a warm welcome for my dad. The Reverend Henry Jones. I want to thank everyone for giving us the opportunity to sing this morning. The tune we're going to do is God's In My Footsteps. I stumble, I stumble like a when I know I should be standing tall. Stay. 
This is the gentleman of the congregation. Us at the Little Green Tea Baptist Church seem to have a little bit of an issue. Now, I don't want to say exactly what the issue is. Well, I'm actually going to get into it right now. We just told a beautiful story about Abraham and Isaac and how God has spared Abraham's son to become a great father. And one thing I notice about some of us fathers, we tend to turn our hands and our faces and our feelings and our spirits away from our children. And the reason why I say this is because I see too many children walking with their pants down. I'm going to call them what they are. They're children. They look like children. No matter how big they are, they still look like children. So I want the congregation to help me make people aware of how stupid they look with their pants down in the back. So we're going to try to get a little song going here. I have my pad. I, where, where's, I had something here for the choir. I, here it is right here. It says, I wrote a little tune. And I think our piano player might be able to pick it up. It goes something like this. It's called, Pull Your Pants Up. I'm just so, so sick of our young black men, white men, Asian men. I don't care what color you are. But you should, you have no business to be dragging a wagon. You, you, you should not be doing that. So, so here we go. The name of the tune is, If You Don't Pull Them Up, Somebody Might See Your Buttercup. So the, total, the, the title of the tone is, Pull Your Pants Up. So the lyrics are, Children, Pull Your Pants Up. Children, pull your pants up. If you don't pull them up, somebody might see your buttercup. Come on, children, pull your pants up. And we're going to see if the choir can do a special rendition of that. And God bless you, and may God keep you. And I'm just telling y'all, we're, we're trying to keep things positive around here. Thank you. From here is ground transportation to headquarters. Man, that's an exciting looking vehicle. What is that? I haven't seen anything like that before. That, my friend, is called an Elio. Don't worry, you have him on your planet next year. Let's get strapped in and I think you're going to enjoy this. <laughs> Go ahead and hit that start button right there. Get these cranked up. Big start button. Ignition on. Big brother, this is Blur. Request clearance to Sector 9. Thank you. Hey, we're moving a little slow, are we not? Hey, you have your residential areas <laughs> and your speed limits. Please don't start with me, not today. <laughs> my bad, my bad. What's the, what's the estimated time of arrival? We'll be there in about, about 10 minutes. Cool. Time. 
you to do is reach down you see the turbo button there reach down on that turbo button when I count to five let's go in one two three four five ignition ignition Thank you. 